This is a snow track, a modernized version of a 1950s snowcat built right here, piece by piece, in North Idaho. Today we attempt to pilot the machine through Kanixu National Forest over bottomless snow, steep terrain, and frozen lakes. This is a real life video game right here. I think we're gonna have great fun today. I brought my snowboard, Ethan brought his snow bike, we brought a bunch of coffee, some plain bagels, and just regular cheese. Why did you get plain bagels? Plain they bagels. only had plain. No. Oh no. <laughs> well, we don't need good bagels, we've got snow <laughs> They build them right back here. No way. Yep. This is, uh, we need some square footage in our lives. It's so nice. This like open space in between your tools is amazing. Yeah. We chopped all the, all the tubing here. And wow. Welded all the frames here and then all the, all the track components and stuff too. See this itty bitty little turbo over Look here? Look at the little turbo. It's think of all the things we can do with that. It's like the size of my hand. That is cool. <laughs> no! This is the first time I've used this drone. The are you first... just saying how you were never gonna crash this head? Yeah, well it's supposed to have 360 optical. What did you hit? This drone has been out for like three days. I'm probably the first person to do this. But we have insurance. Oh no. Because I break a lot of drones, so. I'm kind of a dork, and this was like the thing I was looking forward to most today. He was joking, I was like, oh, this optical avoidance is so amazing, I'll never crash this drone. And he's like, sure you won't. I think you guys have done some test driving in a field, but this is really the maiden voyage, yeah, right? We, we haven't taken it out to like a, a trail yet. How does a little three-cylinder feel like a jet engine? <laughs> Aren't you supposed to like uh, smash the bumper with a bottle of champagne, or is that boats? Nice boats. Oh, okay, it's boats. <laughs> What do you guys got going on in the hood? Burritos in the hood, dude. <laughs> Warming up. Nice, are they warm? Right. Not really, this thing does not run hot. Crap. It's a 180 degree. You just stuck it directly on the uh, <laughs> Oh, that is a tiny there. little baby turbo. Yeah, look how cute that is. <laughs> That's what we need. That's what I was saying. Burritos. How'd you like driving it, Will? Dude, this thing oh, is dude. so fun. This yeah. is like the definition of having fun driving something slow. Hey, it's still faster than snow wheeling. Your turn to drive? Yeah, I figured I'd switch off, let Edwin ride the snow bike for a bit. I'll come in here and dry oh. my pants out. Looks like Ed's having fun. 
I'd say so. Yeah, he's going to be on that. And you know all how day. Edwin loves bikes? Big yep. bikes, small bikes. Big bikes, small bikes, medium sized bikes, bikes three wheeler bikes. He loves them all. Oh, <laughs> yeah. We made it. So the plan is Ethan's going to tow me across this frozen lake as fast as the snow bike will tow me while I'm on a snowboard. You're going to get face blasted. You're going to... Oh, I have a little thing. Yeah, you're going to want that. It's going to be nice. The rope is not that long. It's like maybe 20 feet. It's exactly 20 feet long. All right. But it'll tow 22,000 pounds. Yeah. And it's a uh, kinetic rope, so it'll be nice and soft too. Oh, yeah. That'll be good. That's I like that. It's going to be the best day of work ever. It looked very premium. Ethan just ate it very hard. Hit it! <laughs> snowboarding that fast uphill I've never done that before I've never chased a snowboarder on this before. It's not oh, wow.
Cheers, dude. The finer things in life. You guys are ridiculous. to the trailhead after a very premium day of sending. We got snowboarding in, snow biking in, snow tracking in. We made it all the way to the lake, boosted all around the lake. It was a good time. And honestly, it was kind of nice to be able to ride back in the back of that. Like I snow biked all the way up there and ripped around a bunch and got stuck. So I was tired. And then I let Tristan ride the snow bike and I think I'm gonna have to pry it from his cold cold fingers. <laughs> He's never getting it back. <laughs> exactly. But it was great. I got to ride in the warm, comfortable cab on the way back. Yeah. It's nice. And it is actually warm and comfortable. Oh, yeah. Weird to say because it's just like a metal box, but it's very premium. It's sure. a very premium it's metal like box. Your own little private microwave. It is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Very nice. yeah very next nice. time we got to go up some like really steep switchbacks and then just snowboard straight down. Mm -hmm. Yeah, find yeah. a spot where you can go up the top and make yeah. loops, do laps. Uh -huh. yeah. Yep. That was great. Now we're getting some more fresh snow for the next round. Yeah, it's perfect. Yeah. It's beautiful. What more could you ask for? I don't think anything. Premium. Will Except sleep. for a Hayabusa with no. a snow bike kit on it. <laughs> That's what Will needs. Will yes, needs Will needs sleep. No. This is the longest trip you've been out on, right? Yeah. We did like five hours. That's 10% of the hours on that vehicle is today. Yeah. Yeah, yeah pretty much. It, it had about 50 hours when we started. So what do you think? I mean, it didn't break down. It just, it just went. It just kept going. Yeah. <laughs> it was yeah. really cool to be part of your first real, like, mountain test with it too yeah it's great we've, we've been wanting to take it out to romano's for you know a couple of years now basically and we just <laughs> we've been so busy building snow tracks and right you know like it's hard to it's hard to find time to go out and do stuff so we put in all the entries to win the brz for ten thousand dollars we'll see which one they want right now hey Hello. <laughs> so we uh threw all the people who entered the giveaway in our software and you won the brz that's awesome, that's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. We're You're a lucky man. <laughs> I know. <laughs> yeah, well, it really is the BRZ or 10,000, so you can make your choice. <laughs> oh, man, how long do I have to make my choice? You can, you can take your time. It's yeah, all good. There's, there's no rush. <laughs> yeah. we, we have a couple things we have to do to the BRZ still. we got to get it properly tuned and dynoed and all that. You know, so it's running tip top before we send it out to you, but so you, you got some time. <laughs> it's the probably the best t-shirt you've ever bought, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. <laughs>